Hi everyone, welcome back to with Chili C. Today I'm going to do Henry's hot sauce. So it's Henry's hot sauce, Sentinel Paradise. I did one a little while ago and it was divine. So let's see if this one's as good, right? So you need to check this out. Check out the uh, the label on this one. So Henry's, I'm just trying to do it so you can see it. Sentinel Paradise. And it's actually a really nice like lush brown colour. And if you look in the bottle, you can see the bits. I think you may be able to see some bits at the bottom there. But... We'll open it up so let's see another nice thing because the previous sauce I did a while ago was lovely and really nice consistency this one is got a similar sort of group it's kind of a thick one so let's just I'm just going to take this off and then read the ingredients because I want to show you the pour because it's jam-packed with ingredients flavor and uh, again this is the one chili sauce um, they don't have to be hot it's more about flavor than anything else so look at this neck let's put it in there so i don't know if you can see the ingredients in there but it's a nice pour on that and you've got all of the um flecks in the in the bottle just trying to see if you guys can see it because a camera thing going on okay you'll have to take my word for it there's spices or mixtures of things all the way down the neck along there and i can't see any seeds but it's really nicely blended so Henry's Hot Sauce, a Sentinel Paradise. It says, um, let me just see if there's any write-up. For recipes and serving suggestions, obviously visit the web website. If you buy this one, check out the websites for other suggestions. Um, ingredients, mango. Okay, fruity mango. I've got a bit of sun coming through there, so sorry about that. Uh, mango. Okay, so mango, white wine vinegar, um, red onion, ginger, orange juice, scotch bonnet chilies and spices, and church field salt. So the allergens in here will be the sulfides in your vinegar. So that's the only allergens in here. So you've got your fruit, your tang from your white wine vinegar. So you can, again, with, with just knowing you've got that, you can barbecue with this or marinade with this. And then spices and church fields. So uh, it may have traces of milk, eggs, nuts um, from where it's been packed and made. Once open, obviously put in the fridge. So nothing for it. Here we go. Let's do the aroma. It's a really nice lush, it's not exactly turmeric -y yellow, but it is a lovely sort of um, burnt orange kind of colour. Let's get it down. Mmm, okay, it's quite like a curry. So I'm just thinking mango, it must be the spices. So you've got mango uh, and scotch bonnet, it's ginger, that's it. So it's the ginger and the spices. It's almost like a kind of a curry smell. Mm, yeah, like like a um, mango chutney type smell that almost reminds you of curries. Something for it. I'm just going to have to try this. It's making my mouth water. So here we go. Again, I'm going to try and do a big-ish portion. Let's hope it comes out smoothly. Now, it's quite thick. Look at that. And it's got bits in it. Big mound of it. I'm loving Henry's sauces because the previous one was so good. So check it out. Look at that. Mm-mm-mm. He's cumin in there, um, other spices, he's got a uh, ginger, tang, no heat from the chilies, not as much, but it is only one chilli, so here we go, thank you. Mm, okay, it's really nice, it's got the tang from the mangoes, it's tangy, you get a nice fruit burst initially of mangoes then you've got the cumin coming in the, the spices so it might be like a garam masala or cumin here so it's got the heat obviously it's got one chilli in it and what was the scotch bonnets the, the heat was from scotch bonnet oh hello somebody's come to say hello I'll just close that in case but I'm still tasting the fruit so it's a really nice rich fruity sauce quite flavorful it's got lots of depth to it you've got your cumin coming in I'm just thinking ginger is in there, a hint of ginger coming in. It's not overpowering the ginger, but more mango-y. And mango and cumin, and maybe like a mixture of, maybe a type of garam masala in there. So the, the garam masala type, maybe cloves or something like that. Hint, hints of cloves coming through from the spices. Really nice versatile sauce, that one. Henry's Hot Sauce, Sentinel Paradise. Now that is awesome. It's, it's, you've got... A massive burst of mango, first of all. You've got your spices coming in. Now, obviously, there wasn't a list of spices, so I'm assuming it's cumin, 
hints of clove in there, the ginger comes in, there is a tang to it, and the tang isn't acidic in terms of it's not vinegary tasting, it's more fruity and it's well balanced. Um, the uses for it on here it just says, um, obviously, look for recipes, but because of the low pH, you can marinate with this one, you can put it in your burgers and your barbecues and all of those things. I think you can probably dip with this one, um, you can add it to rice, anything like that, and also Indian food, lots and lots of Indian food like fried all the pakoras, the bhajis, all of those things, samosas, this will go really well with it because it's got the ginger hints and the mango hints in it. Um, just thinking about the other things, cheese board again because it's got that fruit and, it, and the ginger and the tang, that will go nicely with certain cheeses um, and I think cold meats as well, so if you're if you're doing like gammon or ham, all those things, you, know, you can put it in, on your sandwiches, many many uses and with the fruit in it, you can probably even add it on a pizza base because it's you have pineapple. People have I, I I like pineapple on my pizza. I'm one of the people that do. So that could actually go in your in your pizza base, you know, because it will add the fruit tang to it. And um, what can I say about Henry's Sentinel Paradise? The main idea, if somebody who hasn't bought it or hasn't tried it, is you've got a mango chutney. So say you get a mango pickle or a mango chutney. It's more the the mango um, chutney, the shredded and chip chop curry sauce, mix the two together and it's halfway there and it's more on the mango side than the chip chop so it's got the scent and the smell of that curry sauce but yeah it's got so much more fruit packed in it, um, really nice sauce, thank you very much Henry. So Sentinel Paradise, well versatile and the uses that I may have suggested you may have others so please put in comments buy this sauce, try it out, and then just let us know how you went. So guys, you know what to do now, yeah? Order, 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 like, subscribe, lots of comments, and thank you very much for watching.